I was beginning to think you weren't coming. After what happened to Jeremy, I was afraid. See ya. I'm sorry, you can't be at his funeral. It's today, isn't it? Well, that's the problem with marrying a member from your own team. One of you is a target, so is the other. I get it. Hello, darling. All right, let's make this quick. I took a late lunch. But how many times do I have to tell you? I'm not quick about anything. I don't know. What about that time I blew my cover in Prague? You took out that sentry before I could even draw my weapon. Save my ass, Clyde. Mm. I'm surprised you remember the little people from your Interpol days, now that you're a posh FBI profiler. What's being done to locate Doyle? Only every agency of the Northern Hemisphere is looking for him. What are we doing to find him? My contact at DCRI tracked one of Doyle's aliases, leaving France the day after Jeremy's murder. He took a commercial flight to Beijing, then doubled back on a train bound for Berlin. But when GSG-9 intercepted it, he was already gone. He sent me flowers. I think it's safe to assume he's coming here. Why is he doing this? Why do you think we put him away? Duty calls. I know what you're thinking. Absolutely not. Your team isn't under oath. They don't have clearance. They could help. How? We don't even know where Doyle is. Involving them at this point would be premature. And reckless. Leave it to Sienna. You go be with your team. Even in hiding, Doyle can't resist extravagance. Track the money. I will find him, darling. Trust me. I don't trust anyone anymore.